Kaji Mpasho Grammars, I'm hanging out with the one and only Trevor Ombija. Yay, yeah, this is it. Yes, this yes. is it. Now I'm you... nervous, by the way. Why? Because I've never been on this side. Yes, I know, right? Ask the questions. I don't yes. get asked the questions. Yes. So let's see how this one goes. And you know, here at Mpasho, yeah. we are always bold and true and very friendly. Let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> friendly, I'm not too sure. Bold, yes. <laughs> yes. We are bold. Now, first all right. of all, you know, um, on social media, our fans have been asking, what is your, you know, fitness secret? Woo! Fitness secret. Yes. So here's the thing. I go to the gym three or four times in a week, yeah. but I do it as a hobby. So I don't have a specific day. Yeah. Maybe... I just decide. It's, if you do it as a hobby, yeah. it's much easier than if you do it as a routine that you have to. So I do it because I like it. Yeah. yeah. So I fit it in between my my schedule, depending on when I'm free, three or four times in a week. That's yeah. it. Yeah. You know, recently we saw your photos with Akina Larimado, and everybody was like, lamu, "Hey, lamu, lamu, tamu things, yes." But you saw see all your comments see section. Photoshop, see your Photoshop, Photoshop, by the way. This is yeah. it. It's really there. I'm an English Yeah, but I'm I feel for them. Yeah. Right, yeah. Let's do it. Okay. Is oh. it really there? Yes. <laughs> oh my goodness. It is so actually see Photoshop. there. See Photoshop. Oh my goodness. It is actually there. How does your DM look like? It is intense. Mm -hmm. And many people who are all with in campus yeah. have been sending me messages about the same thing. Yeah, and the DMs. I mean, people express themselves much more boldly yeah. this time yeah. than way back in the time. So people are very interesting. They send messages in terms of, can I be your girlfriend? Yes. Can I take you out for dinner? Yes. Can I take you out for coffee? Yeah. But I appreciate it. It's yeah. just people appreciating what they see and that's about it. I, I don't take it beyond that. Yeah. So sometimes I just say, it's a standard message I respond to almost everyone as yeah. much as I can. Sometimes yeah. there are too many. But I just say thank you. Okay. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're thank far too kind. Yeah. Thank you, you're far too kind. Yeah. That's about it. It's always wow. my auto response because they're just appreciating what they see. Yeah. yeah. Okay guys, the next time you think of DMing Trevor, he'll tell you thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And that's me by the way. Yeah? It's me who's, who's responding to your DMs. I, I don't have a manager. I do it myself. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. So sometimes it takes a bit of time and some people get upset yeah. because they send a message like a week down the line. They're like, I sent your message, you didn't respond. Yes. Yo, I will get to your message. Just take, it takes a bit of time. There are quite a number, but I will get to your message. And I appreciate all the love. Yo, Mshaskia, but they answer could DM right now. Right now, yeah. And also, and now, uh, do you get like extreme, you know, apart from the yeah. girlfriend, do you get extreme, like what kind? They're always extremes. People send you nudes all the time. And I'm sure I'm not the only one who goes through this. People yes. send you nude pictures. Now, those ones I don't respond to yeah. because that's a bit on the extreme side. I appreciate people saying thank you, yeah. but that's about it. But you, if you send me a nude, I will not respond to it because that's next level stuff. Yeah, yeah. So I, I, I think that's, it's almost condescending, yeah. so to speak. So I prefer the normal, you look beautiful, you look nice, you look awesome. Yeah. That one is fine. But when you go to the level of sending nudes, I ignore. Yeah. It's not that I don't see. I just signal, <laughs> yeah. yeah, because hey, you are pa, yeah, papa na. Hey, you na choma, you na choma, you na choma. And also now, um, people have been asking as well. Are you taken? Are you single? Are you dating? This one is equal to taka kujibu. I was hoping it doesn't come up, but you know, now that now that it's here, let's address yes. it. So here's the thing. Mm -hmm. Right now, as it stands, I yeah. am single. You are? Yeah. I am single right now, but I used to be in a relationship. Yes. It was badly heartbroken. That's about it. Yeah. I know, right? Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> you know, you know, you know, you you know, you know, you 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 and are you available? Not looking. Not, not looking at all? No, I need to fix myself first. Yeah. I went through some heartbreak yeah. that I need to fix myself first. Yeah. yeah. Listen, everybody deserves the best version of the other person. Don't go into a relationship when you're broken. Yeah. Right now, I am broken. I'll admit it. People don't admit that all the time. I am broken because I'm from a relationship that lasted 10 years. Yeah. Mmm. Ilinivunja. <laughs> Hero yeah. imebaki na kuambia ni adamu tu. Oh my goodness, yeah. baki pole sana. When when was the relationship over? Sasa, here's the thing. 
So it's one of those relationships that were over mm -hmm. and then they're not over, yeah. then they're over again yeah. because you know 10 years down the line you just can't leave. Yes. Yeah, and uh, I actually took dowry to a place in 2015, 5th of December. Can you believe it? But who's counting? Who's counting? Yeah. Then Akaniacha. Imagine. Mm. Aliniacha. Do you know what she said? What did she say? She needs to find herself. And, and I was like, I have found you. You're right here. I have found you. <laughs> but she still left me anyway, so yeah. Do you so think Uli force? And I'm not available. Yeah. yeah. Do you think Uli force? Nilijaribu ku force issues for a while, eh? Yeah. Yeah, unajua vile unaachuanga alafu unajaribu ku insist that yo baby we can work this out sijui nini and then it finally sinks that wenyewe umeachwa. Na ukiachwa achika. Sasa mimi nimekubali kuachika. Sasa nimeachwa so I'm just fixing myself. The only therapy I have is the gym. Unajua gym by the is a weight ni mzito kila siku. There's no day you'll ever go to the gym alafu ikwambie ti I don't love you anymore. The weights will always be heavy. <laughs> you can't count on that. Yeah. You can't count on human beings. Yeah. What? What's an equambia? You can't count on human beings. I'm telling you, Trevor looks very heartbroken, even at this particular moment. But you can put your ten years. Ten years ukapeleka dowry. Uli rudishiwa maliako. No. That's being petty. Nili yeah. achana nae. So let it go. Yeah. But do you want know the funny thing? Mm -hmm. We're still very good friends. How now? Sasa, e ground I take makasiriko. <laughs> ground I take makasiriko yeah. by the. So mo na saizi Dr. Alfred Buntu ako apa na Lilian Nganga. Yes. Na siwali tuambi wa mea chana. Yes. Yeah. Mo na fanya nini pamoja? You are supporting. Me. Ground I take makasiriko. Yeah. Uki achua achika. Yeah. Be mature about it. Yeah. The only thing is, don't take your drama to the next relationship. Yes. That's it. Yeah. Fix yourself first. Yeah then move on to the next yeah. relationship. So no, I'm not available now because I'm trying to figure this out. Yeah. I'm trying to figure me out. You're not I'm not trying to find myself. Yeah. I'm trying to find myself now. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> 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 I am so petty by the way. No need, no need. Yeah. Speak to people, understand. Yeah. Because always when you're left, there's a role you played, you know? Yes. Yeah, so it's easy to say, I'm innocent. There's a role I've played. So if I don't figure that out, I'll probably take the same toxicity yes. to the next relationship. So I'm trying to just figure me out. And then when the time is right, I, the Lord, shall make it happen. You know that's the Bible? True. Yes. Yes. True. yes. True. And when that time comes and then Ulipadori, Kila Kitu Ikuepua, walk down the aisle, Uta to invite? Yeah. Specifically, <laughs> invite. And I invite like invites only. Ah, <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> if you have anything to say, this is a time of forever for all your peace. And then what what do I do? Excuse me, Pastor. We are Jamani Wangu. not even excuse. It will be it will be invites only. We will to na storm to na kuja for our comes. It will be invites only. Yes. Yeah. Now um ten years in the relationship, what have you learned? A lot of things. First of all, learn to listen. Yeah, people don't people forget what you said, but they never forget how you made them feel. Yeah. And learn to listen. And always be honest. That's what I say. When you feel like something is not working out, yeah. talk about it. Yeah. You know, half the time people lose the best people they have simply because they had no guts to communicate. Yeah. That's one. The other half is people talk to each other when they're hungry. Usiongeleshe mtu sazila nasikia nja. Sazila nasikia nja hata choma. Usiongeleshe mtu sazila nasikia nja. But most important, talk. Yeah. Talk as much as you can. And listen. Don't, don't listen to respond. Yeah. Listen to what the other person is saying. Yeah. If they say this doesn't work for me, understand why it doesn't work for them. Yes and then give your perspective. Mtu asianze kukuambia ati sipendi hii na wewe unataka tu respond. Listen to what they're saying. One thing that I learned from all relationships, listen. People tell you who they are. And by the way when people tell you who they are the first time, yeah. believe them. Yeah, believe them. Usianze ku insist that you nimekuona na kafiti. I'm trying to insist that you're an angel, maybe you're not. You've already told me what you're struggling with. If I can't compliment you, and relationships are all about compromise. Yeah. You're different people. Khalil Gibran, the prophet, the book says that look at a building and a roof. It is held together by two pillars. When you look close, you'll realize those two pillars stand apart. So should be the institution of marriage. Yeah. Husband and wife hold the roof of their family together, but they must always stand apart. Yeah. It's very true. 
Don't force things. Usi force vitu, usi force issues. Na ukiachwa pia achika. Venye Trevor aliachika. Ase, niko tu hapa kwa ground sasa nimekuwa tu socialite. Ati amekuwa tu socialite. Wewe uko na zoma picha? Gani? Zalamu. Zalamu moliweza. Zimewaka. What was happening by the way Lamu nini ilikuwa inafanya? Here's the thing we were a group of like almost 15 people just having fun. We were a group of almost 15 people just having fun. I didn't even think those pictures would have that kind of reaction. I mean yeah. I was just pulling the dow yeah. and Larry took the pictures. Yes. That was it. Yeah. I, I didn't even think they would have that kind of reaction. Yeah. Generally I'm a skinny guy so it's very easy for me to get a six pack. Yeah and it was like a vacation you guys were on? Yeah, right after that, we were from Watamu, then we went to Lamu. It was just a weekend, just yeah. guys having fun. And now we are going to Atlanta. When? When? September. When? September is my birthday on the 9th of September. So, Nanzia Dubai, and I'm going bungee jumping. Kelele, kelele, vitu kama hizo, things that get you to the edge. And then to end Atlanta. Also, we're just going to Atlanta because Larry is holding on CNN yeah. for a bit. So, so. unasema tu, ni wewe na nani? Uni watu wengi. Oh, ni watu you and your team. Mimi, Larry, Gabantu, Masima Roma, Masiranda. There are quite a number of people. Yeah. yeah. And that's exclusive too, Mpasho. And of course, you know, you Atlanta. My photos are taken. Pictures in Akuja. Like in some pictures are shirtless. Yeah, to not talk about it. To not iso. That is what we love, you know. No, we're going to socialite once. Only once. Next. So, as you feel, you see Photoshop. It's not Photoshop. That is, yeah. you know. But in your two up. No. <laughs> but Nisawa, you know, do you have like a personal project you're working on or you want to work on in future? Many, many, many projects. But most of the time, I want to retire by the time I'm 40. I'm turning 34 on the 9th of September. So I only have six years. 34. Is that the right page for marriage? It, it, it is. 34, 34. You, you, your own pace. No problem. Your own yeah. pace. Yeah. It's a, it's a couple of projects, but mostly I want to go into consultancy. I'm already working on that, yeah. but that's about it. I don't want to reveal too much. I prefer doing things rather than saying them. Yeah. yeah. So personal projects are there. Na pia kuna karuma flani at sijua I'm running for MP in 2022. Is it true? No. So no politics, nothing? At some point. I will. Not in 2022. Yeah. So. Uh, I will at some point. Because you see, the thing is, we all complain about things. Nobody's willing to step up. Yeah, they say it. Oh, politics is a dirty game. Who will clean up? Nani ata clean up kama watu nyoko na sabuni wanaka uko kwa trenches wa ke insist that politics is a dirty game. We always have to step up. Yeah. So I will step up at some point. Yeah. Just not in 2022. Because you know, uh, everybody, m not everybody, m but most people wanna say matuna ingia politics, you know, when you mesema ku clean up and then una ingia, una relax, Trevor. Well, una kwa tu kama hawa ingine, sindio? Hey, that's what they say, but I, I genuinely believe even the young politicians are trying to push. Yeah. The only thing is, there's a way the system works. Yeah. yeah, and you have to abide by it. You can't reinvent the wheel. Mm -hmm. But if we have enough people who have the right mindset in there, yeah. change will definitely come. Yeah. yeah. So for me it will come, but not now. Yeah. Mm. Doing a very great job on TV, that's why you're one of my favorites, by the way. <laughs> Don't let me stop you. <laughs> Trevor, I just want to know, because we, we've seen, you know, you handle smooth interviews and everything. Have you ever had a worst interview? Yeah. Who? Charles Owino. And what Miguna, happened? And Miguna Miguna. <laughs> you know, there was a time I was interviewing Charles Owino and Boniface Mwangi. Uh -huh. While his mama was studio. Charles Owino was like, I can't tackle this man. He shouldn't be even on this table. That was Boniface Mwangi because he was insisting on police brutality, which is something we're still dealing with up to now. Yeah. My heart was racing because I was like, these people are going to fight in studio. Yeah. Those days I was on TV. I was on back in the day, about four or five years ago. Yeah, that, that got my adrenaline rushing because I was like, how to kishikana up and beliangu dafanya aze? So, you know, deep down you're like, guys, sit down, sit down, but uko kwaro yako, iku karibu kutoka. You're like, you're like, how to dafanya aze? You need up and beliangu. But yeah. So, you act comfortable. So, here's one thing that I live by. The essence of courage yeah. does not mean that your heart should not quake, yeah. but that nobody should know it does. So neza mama hapa hivi ni me shake yangu yote, but as long as I'm looking at you like this, yeah. you think I am calm and confident. Lakini I'm just like, guys, calm down, guys, calm down. Let's talk, let's be decorum, decorum, ni 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 ni. But saizo chalso wina mesmama. 
walikuwa wameka chini amesimama yeah. i can tackle this man right here yeah. yeah so i was thinking guys please don't do it sasa hizo ndio director anakuambia Trevor control the interview and i'm yeah. like i'm trying yeah. i'm trying yeah. should i be shouting at them <laughs> yeah but that, those are one of my intense interviews do you have like an embarrassing moment on tv not really i try to keep it together yeah. all the time yeah. i i don't say anything that will embarrass me i try to keep it together all the time yeah I have so many embarrassing moments on interview. I am not on live on air but still I do. By the way, um a question just ca- came in, yeah? Do you believe in marriage? That's not a, this is not the right time to ask me that question. <laughs> I know, I know, but do you? This is not the right time to ask me that question. Yes, I do. I do. Yeah. But it is a very deliberate effort from both of you. Yeah. Both of you have to be willing to compromise. Yeah. Both of you have to be willing to talk all the time. And it is a lot of work. Yeah. And it has to be both sides. Yeah. Si ati mtu mmoja anaeka 40% mwingine anaeka 60. You all have to do 50-50. Yes. Compromise is the biggest thing for marriage. Yeah. Yeah. So tra- for the right time and the right people. Yeah. Very very true. We'll just let you go and Thank you know you. heal. Yeah. <laughs> go and heal. Aki unaongelesha watu aje? Unaongelesha boys and aje? Go and <laughs> Na albe fine. Aya sente tu kuniombea ta wewe jamani. You know the way DP Ruto says waombeeni jamani. Yes. Waombe. Yeah. That's it. So kuombea you'll get the right person. Yeah. <laughs> <I'm not. laughs> <laughs> Sawa. Na sente sana Trevor we really have time. Many time. Aya sente. You're an amazing journalist as well. Keep doing your best. We will retire very soon. Yeah. You take up our position. Yeah? yeah? All the best. Thank you so much. Yeah. And that's Trevor on Vija right here on Pasho. My name is Kalondi Musimi. Uniombe tafadhali. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Behind the camera is the one and only Ivy Madani.